What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Lil Tony, and y'all already know what it is and what it ain't. And shout out to the armies all over the world. And I know y'all seen this video. I mean, seen the title of the video and was like, Tony, what is going on? Nothing is going on, okay? I just look at it like, if we gonna keep trying to better the community, right? I know I'm a G cooker, right? But I put Tay Cook on the back burner. Like, I don't react to Tay Cook, right? And I have a lot of Tay Cook fans. You know what I'm saying? I have a lot of, and I'm going. To, I'm just going to be honest with you guys. You know what I'm saying? And why I say this, one of my subscribers that been subscribed to me for nine months publicly, it shows you, like, how long you guys been subscribed to me. She's been subscribed to me for nine months. And she's always active on my channel. She DM'd me on Twitter and was like, Tony, boom, boom, I'm a, I'm a Tay Cook fan, but I also, I love your G-Cook videos. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, that's what I'm known for, my G-Cook videos. You guys love them. I love them. I think they're real, right? But she said, I'm also a Tay Cook. You know what I'm saying? And I love Tay Cooks. And it's kind of a bummer that my favorite YouTuber doesn't watch Tay Cook videos because of the toxic fans. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't be like that. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't be like that. And I'm sitting back and I told her. I responded back and I told her. I told her. I responded back and I told her. I'm like, you're right. You're right. You know what I'm saying? You're right. I should still make the videos and just give my opinion. It, it doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't. How can I say it? Well, it kind of does matter because some people do take the stuff to heart. But I shouldn't. If I'm going to react to BTS ships, I should react to all the BTS ships. You know what I'm saying? Basically, that's what she was saying. And I, and, I, and I understand her. You know what I'm saying? I understand her because I got other people on my channel that like to see other stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think it's called Soap. S-O-P-E. I'm going to watch that next. You know what I'm saying? V-Ho. All the ships. I'm going down the line. So no ship is going to be left out. You know what I'm saying? No ship is going to be left out. And if you're on my channel, Tay Cook and G Cook, is, we love each other. Uh, the shippers, we love each other. So if you on this channel, oh well, oh well. Tay Cook, G Cook, shippers, one, okay, one, one. We gotta stop the uh, Tay Cook versus G Cook. We gotta stop it. We gotta stop it. And I know I'm gonna be the voice. I didn't got bombed out so many times already, okay? So many times, so many times. And you guys even see me getting bombed out, getting bashed and stuff. I didn't have death threats. I never had death threats. You know what I'm saying? Not all the long time, all the stuff that I did on YouTube. I never had nobody send death threats over a video, over an opinion. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, we're going to get into this video. It's a six, six clear signs. That shows Tay Cook love each other. Let's watch it, baby. Let's watch it. As y'all know, though, I know y'all gonna be mad, but why are you watching it? I'm a G Cooker, but I still love Tay Cook. What? Get out your feelings. I can be a, I, I can love Tay Cook and be a G Cooker. The heck? That's what's wrong with the community right now. Like, it's so segregated. No, we gotta stop that and stop bringing it together. Okay, you gotta stop that. Just because you like G Cook, that don't mean you don't have to watch Tay Cook. No, it's just you gotta watch who you watch Tay Cook, who who makes them videos like Tay Cook Glass. You can't watch her videos. You know what I'm saying? Whereas though she telling you what. Let's get into the video, guys. Like I said, Tay Cook, Tay Cook, and G Cook. We all can live in the same world. We all can eat at the same table. Point blank period. Six signs. Six clear signs that shows Tay Cook love each other. Let's go, y'all. Let's go. I want to say that. Thank you so much. I'm really overwhelmed. I'm going to talk about. Here are six clear signs he's in love with you. Number one. He enjoys poking fun at you on a regular basis. Although teasing is a common form of flirting in the initial stages of dating, over time, when they get to know and fall in love with you, they start to come up with inside jokes. I'm sorry, I know I'm supposed to be watching the video, but I was going to fact that just because teasing and teasing don't always, it's not a form of sign of before dating. 
because all the member teases each other. You know what I'm saying? And it, and if you watch my Vmin video, I said it in the Vmin video. I think Jimmy always picking on Tay. You know what I'm saying? Like a big brother, little brother love. Like, and they showed it through the whole clip. You know what I'm saying? So I did. I would just have to fact check. So I don't agree on her with that. Only you understand that make it more exclusive and special. People in love tend to be more in tune with their playful youthfulness. It's important to be able to laugh with your partner so you can handle all life's curveballs thrown your way. Thank you. Thank you. Number two, he opens up about things that are hard to talk about. This is especially true if your partner is more shy or reserved. See, but see, guys, the only thing with Tay Cook videos is like they automatically like couple, like straight couple. Like it just, it, I don't know. It's just like the Tay Cook videos is way different than the G Cook videos. Okay, the G Cook videos, you gotta be the judge. You know what I'm saying? You have to judge it your own self. Whereas though, when I watch Tay Cook videos, this is a prime example. Whereas though, she's telling you already like they're a couple, like. She's explaining the story like they were a couple. Like that's that's just the difference. You feel what I'm saying? That's the difference. But I love Eclipse. If he lets his guard down and shows his vulnerable side, it means you're becoming someone who can trust and depend on. Number three, he pays attention to details about you. It's common for people to remember things about you when they're initially trying to impress you. When they're in love, it goes deeper than that. People in love pay attention to the details, big or small, because they genuinely find you interesting and enjoy learning everything about you. If you think your partner is beginning to know you better than you know yourself, there's a pretty good chance he's falling for you. Number four, he becomes more open-minded about trying the things you like. Whether it means going to a restaurant you've been dying to visit or trying something as bold and dramatic as skydiving, people in love are willing to step out of their comfort zone to make unique memories with you. Just being open-minded about your interests and hobbies is a clear sign he cares about you enough to support them. When someone is in love, the last thing they'll do is be dismissive or judgmental towards you, so don't worry about embracing your true self. Number five, he's protective of you and helps you get through your bad days. It's easy to love someone at their best, but the ultimate test of love is being able to accept one another at each other's worst. In relationships, you are challenged to become a better person. When someone is willing to help you get through your bad days, not only is it a sign of maturity, but it shows that you have a stable relationship built on trust, compassion, and understanding. Number six. <laughs> He's at ease around you and doesn't feel pressured to change. We're rarely ever our true selves when we're dating someone in the first few months. It kind of feels like a prolonged interview, but when you're in love, dating stops feeling like a performance and more like home. You'll notice that he'll stop feeling self-conscious about himself, whether that means having bed hair in the morning or just dancing in front of you. 
When the walls start coming down, that's when you know you've truly reached his heart. Don't you know, I like the sounds that they have to No, listen, guys, we are not offended by, no, this is, this is, this is the thing, guys. This is the thing. Listen, listen, if you made it to the end of this video, listen, this is the thing. We not offended. You know what I'm saying? Because nobody hates Taker. That's, that's, that is the main problem because when somebody don't like a Taker video, a video that like a third party then made, then it's automatically they don't like Tay. You know what I'm saying? No. No. It just sometimes the videos are just pushing it too much. You know what I'm saying? Whereas though, and I'm not trying to compare them, but I'm just going to speak facts. Whereas though, the G Cook videos, you have to do, you do your, it, 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 it's self explanatory. You feel what I'm saying? Whereas though, Tay Cook videos, it's people that's telling you. This is what's going on. Like, this is what's going on, and this is what's happening, and this is how it's happening. You feel what I'm saying? That's the two different things. You feel what I'm saying? That is the two different things. And I've seen it with this video. I've seen it with this video. Sometimes you push it a little too far. Hey, YouTube, it's your boy, Lil Tony. <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Mama!